Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Kayla and this is just going to be a little makeup and all about me. So, hope you enjoy. Um, we're going to first start off with foundation. This is the Morphe F280 Matte Foundation. This is also a second layer. I put some on off camera to see if I wanted to use this and I do for this video. But I gotta say, you might want to moisturize before using this. Alright, first fun fact, um, I'm quirky. That's probably the first thing you should probably learn about me, is I am very quirky, especially on camera. And we're just gonna cover up our lips too. I don't typically do that, but we're going to anyway. So, next fun fact is typically in my makeup I hate matte looks, but I will do them anyway. But I have to be very well moisturized before I do this, which I am not. That's okay. I am a dog lover, but I think I like cats more. Yeah, I love cats more. <laughs> I need a kitty baby named Willa. She passed away, but I love cats. Um, I'm married with a little baby. And when I mean baby, I mean a baby. Not like my little seven-year-old little children. No, I have one child and uh, it's a beautiful baby girl and she is so cute and yeah, being a new mom is not easy but I love every second of it. Um, now we are going to conceal. Yeah, we're going to use their concealer in the shade C3.5. 55, and this is also by Morphe. I am originally from Georgia in the US, and I'm just gonna put a little bit more concealer on here and here and here. Alrighty, so let's see what's next. Um, I have a degree, an associate's degree in business management. And my birthday's in June. This is all random stuff, by the way. It's not in any specific order. I love vintage style anything. I love going antique shopping. I love wearing flannels and cute tank tops. Um, I hate bugs. <laughs> I love flowers. Um, roses are my favorite. Next would be I think the next one would be daisies. I really do like daisies. Never had any, but I love seeing them out. Oh, and I love hibiscus flowers. They are beautiful. Our Morphe blush in the shade Spirit. Let's see what else. I am 21 years old. My favorite food would probably be pasta, specifically shrimp fra diable. Well, my interpretation of it, um, but I'll have a different video on that. Um, we're going in with the Morphe bronzer in the shade Debutante. I think that's how you pronounce it. Where did I 
start. I'm still learning makeup, by the way, as you can see. Because I applied way too much bronzer and it's slightly darker, so it's more like a contour more than anything. I started my makeup journey doing makeup when I was in high school before that I had like a mascara and a lip gloss and that's all I really wore and I think I might have had like one highlight that I threw on my lids and on my nose um, but as I got into high school I got more and more into makeup um, my uncle is actually the one who started doing makeup when I was a little girl he used to do my makeup for Halloween we're going in with their highlighter spark but yeah for Halloween he would always do my makeup and I had some of the best makeup that I've seen for little kids um, like costumes like I mean like the ones that you like you see like really cute like full done professional kids makeup I've basically had that and it's awesome it's straight up awesome um my uncle still does makeup by the way all right, we are now gonna go into the Happy Hour palette. And we're gonna go into the shade Mixer. We're gonna take this brush. I already have some bronzer in my crease, so. I typically don't do both eyes on camera, but I'll just do both eyes since I've got some time to spare. Um, let's see, what else? Favorite color, I love pastels. Pastel anything, honestly. I'm a rainbow type of girl. I pretty much like all the colors. I don't think there's really a color that I don't like maybe dark blue like a dark royal blue um it's just not the best color on me but hmm, who knows i didn't like that as a kid but maybe it looks better on me now um taking the same brush we're gonna go into cheers Favorite makeup brands would have to be, and we'll clean this up later, we'll ha would have to be ColourPop and Morphe. But yeah, um... My uncle started giving me makeup that he never used and I ended up using it to do a natural makeup look. When I was in high school, I would have highlight, bronzer, mascara, eyeshadow, and a lip. I didn't wear blush, I didn't wear foundation, I didn't wear concealer really, and I didn't start really using those products until like I was working as a hostess and I would have like pimples here and there and they were really red and I didn't want them to show. Like, obviously, you're still going to see a pimple, but I didn't want it to look so bad. So I started taking foundation from a dollar store and using it as concealer. So after that, 
I learned my lesson with having breakouts in reaction to cheap makeup, so I started buying better quality. Let's see what else. Okay, I am a Cancer. That is my sign. Um, and I do love going to the pool. I'm terrified of the ocean, but I will stick my feet in the water, or at least up to like midway before I. I'm just like nope, no more, and run closer to the shore. Um, what else? Um, just really trying to blend as much of that out. Going back in the mixer, blending with some more. Um. Oh, I'm not an outdoorsy person. I would rather do stuff indoors. I like being outside, but only to a certain extent. Um, I am not athletically inclined. I was more so as a kid. Like, I was climbing up trees and trying to play baseball and everything. But nowadays, nope. Um, hmm. I don't want to give too much away in this all about me because there's still like stuff I want to tell throughout the channel but speaking of channel for this channel I kind of wanted to be makeup skincare hair care just basically all about beauty and you know helping people reach their own perception of beauty that has been my ultimate life goal um, so that's what I want to do here and I hope I can do that. I'm gonna show also like maybe do some vlogs, whether it's like recipe vlogs, cooking vlogs, or just, you know, just going around town and everywhere. I'm gonna take a spritzer right here. Oh, I'm sure you can see in the mirror. Um, I do like to paint. I'm not like a professional painter, but I do like to paint. All right, we have a spritzer right here. And we're just gonna throw this on the lid. Very softly, not harsh enough to like create a line. see what else I'm more I love wearing gold but I'm more of a silver um, I love handbags I love dressing in comfy clothes so if you guys see me in a tank or in my pajamas and stuff doing my makeup that's just how I am or if you see me in a robe with like a tank under it that's just how it is sometimes I just throw on makeup just cuz and obviously with the state of how the world is I'm not going out like that so especially not with a new baby so yeah um, my favorite animal are dolphins and pandas I love pandas favorite holiday would probably be Christmas but I equally love Halloween as well so I'm kind of tied for those I am definitely a beauty queen type of person um, we're now going to go into the shade rooftop I don't have the most interesting flat, I'm gonna tell you that right now. Um, we're gonna go back into Cheers. And just 
just reapply it to the outer corner and blend it with the shimmer. But yeah, I don't, you will not see me jumping out of airplanes and doing my makeup. You won't see me, you know, doing pranks on people or anything like that or doing anything crazy or wild because first of all, I can't afford that. And second of all, I have seriously bad anxiety when it comes to doing extreme stuff. I think the most extreme thing you might see me do is pain pulling. I've never been pot paintballing, but I've always wanted to do it. I've done laser tag, it's fun. But nothing really extreme. I don't have a set filming schedule yet. Um, I'm already managing a different account, but I'm gonna keep it completely separate because that account is kind of just where I act goofy, don't really know where I'm heading. In that direction, we're gonna take the Essence Volume Hero Mascara. Yeah, it's kind of just where I just go if I want to do, like, something crazy, but, like, not be, like, serious about it. It's also go, it's also where I go if I want to, like, rant or something. I don't wear lashes. Um, I hate wearing lashes. I hate wearing false lashes. I just like to have a really good mascara. I'm addicted to buying makeup. And skincare. Not so much hair care because I kind of have a set thing of what I buy and that's pretty much it. Oh, my nose is itchy. We are then gonna take this Oh, this is an Urban Decay brush. It's like one of my only like name brand brush. I might have like a Morphe brush and some Eco and Essence brushes, but like this is probably one of my only high-end brushes. Um, we're gonna take Mixer again. And throw it right under. Like completely under. Oh, I'm obsessed with Korean makeup. Honestly, I love when anybody of Asian descent or Asian like culture or race does their makeup because I just think it is the most like prettiest and naturalist makeup that I've ever seen. It's almost like doll-like and I love it. It's so... I don't know, it's just something about it. It just like reminds me so much of like dolls and porcelain, like I hate por- one thing I hate, I hate porcelain dolls, but these remind me of like the cute little Asian porcelain dolls that my grandma had. They were, ch I think they were Chinese and they were absolutely beautiful and those were the only porcelain dolls that I've never been scared of because they were so tiny, they didn't look like children. So, you know, going back into Cheers and we're gonna go as close as we can. and just go, probably, how am I gonna do this? Okay, we're just gonna go only halfway. And then slowly but sure blend it out. And then flip this brush. And with that same mixer shade that's on the brush, blend out. My under eyes are very sensitive, so that's why I don't aggressively blend under there. 
and then the same to the next eye. And also that makeup just shows me how I can make my under eyes, like my bag when my eyes are a bit baggy, like they are right now, how to make them look cute. Just knocked over my foundation, but that's okay. For this look, I didn't want to be too sharp, so that's why it looks the way it does. Alright, we're going to wipe off that sheer shade that we had on this brush, and we're going to go into our inner corner now and go for the shade Hot Spot and pop it in the inner corner. I just said inner corner like three times, two, three times in that sentence. actually a nice subtle pretty color I like that draw it a little outward but yeah that's kind of cute all right we're now gonna take the shade flame for their cream oh no this is the matte lipstick this is like my go-to shade That's the one thing I don't like about putting on lipstick when I have foundation on my lips. It's because it dries out my lips. And I also always seem to mess up. Dang it! Alright, so we're going to go into the shade Single AI and I did Over Fling. Alright, you guys, full disclaimer, I live near an airfield. Um, I'm not going to be specific which airfield, but you might hear aircrafts going over. And then we're going to take a little bit of concealer, just a tad bit. a mirror over here, by the way. I'm going to just use that to soften up this lip. Um, I typically would take a setting spray and a setting spray now, usually the e.l.f. makeup mist. And where is my pants? And... Oh, and last fun fact, my hair is indeed naturally curly, and I have bleached it one time. Not one time. I have bleached it and I have rocked green, pink, and red hair as well as partially blonde and I decided to dye it back and this is what my hair looks like. But yeah, um, sometimes you might see it straight and sometimes you might see it up, sometimes you might see it down. But that is it for today's video. Please like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!